And Massey takes this one to center field. Harris is going back, a chance for a grand slam. It's the third time's a charm. It's not, it's gonna hit the top of the wall, so it's gonna send two runners home. And it's gonna be a grand slam. They're gonna give it to Michael Massey. So the third straight time he hits it out of the ballpark, it's finally fair. And Michael Massey puts the line at 4 1 with his fourth home run of the season. Wow, Michael Massey, that was an absolute show of an at bat. Two foul ball home runs, and then you go deep to center. Are you kidding me? Wow, Michael Massey batting in the three hole today with a grand slam to dead center. Jawan Harris had to keep going back and hit the top of the wall, so I thought it was gone at first. Season around, series at a time. And now it takes time. this one to right field. Looking back is Bauer Big Nitz gone. Illinois' second home run of the fourth inning. It's a two run shot for Jack L with his third home run of the season. And he's having a great series. He keeps it going. That was my pick to have a good game today. It kind of came through for me. Two-run home run here in the bottom of the third. The first six Illini have reached base and scored here in this third inning. And Illinois has opened this one up 6-1 to one on a beautiful swing from the Illinois right fielder, Jack Elwitz. It's a really good middle infield for Illinois. And look at the range by Michael Massey. That is really nice. That's not an easy throw, too. He's far away from first base. Arizona, both supposed to be really good this year. Corey takes that one back up the middle towards center field. Harris going home is Turch in the throw. Not in time. It's an RBI single for Jeff Corey. And it's 8 for Illinois. Zach Taylor takes this one to the gap in right center. Coming around the score is Grant Van Scoy. Taylor going for his second double of the game. It's going to be a triple now as he heads the third base for a sliding triple. No throw. His first triple of the season. And his second base hit of the game. Illinois is up 9-4. 14 in the third innings and seven appearances. And Ben Troy takes it to center field. It will drop. Zach Taylor will be sent home. So... An RBI base knock for Ben Shorty, his 17th RBI of the season. And Illinois has started off this fifth inning with three base hits. And, you know, he didn't really hit the one too hard. Just kind of got under it and hit but you're, all of his You runs. just look to get innings out of your Sunday starter. That's been the case so far today. And that's six innings. I don't think Illinois knew that that was the third out thing, but it was. So Ty Weber, another 1-2-3 inning. He gets Walker striking out, swinging. Still out there in ninth inning, a 2-2 count to Walker. Walker swings and a miss. He's tagged. And Ty Weber is the complete game, a 10-4 victory for Illinois and the 400th win in Dan Harlop's career at Illinois. A phenomenal win for the Illini. They sweep the Rutgers Scarlet Knights, get to 9-3 in Big Ten play.